thought I turned this thing down last night. Sorry, Kenny. I thought the alarm was turned down last night. I know you don't like the alarm. Huh? Oh, Jenny, always wanting more sleep time. I don't think I'll give you another hour. There we go. I hope you sleep well, baby. Now, time for work. Morning, SpongeBob. Morning, Patrick. What's up? Oh, nothing much. Are you heading to the Krusty Krab again? Yep, let me guess. You're gonna head there now to get a Krabby Patty. Not today, this time. I heard there's something going on later today, and there will be some food there. Really? What is it? Oh, it's a secret, Spongebob. Ah, cuss those little secrets. Well, I would love to stay in chat, but those Krabbies aren't gonna flip themselves. See you later, Patrick. Bye, Spongebob. Patrick, did you just told Spongebob what's going on? I only said that something big is going to happen today. Patrick, you big idiot! Do you realize how hard we tried to keep this a secret from Spongebob? No. Well, a lot! And we don't need you spoiling it to him! Okay, okay, I'm sorry. You better be! Man, I'm already speaking like Squidward. I can't tell if that's a good thing or not. Well, who cares? Better head off to where Sonic is. <sighs> Smurfette, what are you doing this early in the morning? What do you think? Baking a cake? Baking a cake? For what? Check what day it is, and you will find out. Okay... Wait, it's Spongebob's birthday? Yep. Jenny has been trying to get a party in the Krusty Krab to celebrate it. Well, isn't he working there today? Yes, but we're having the pro party as a surprise, just when his shift is over. Ah, clever idea there. So, I take it you didn't get him a present? Well, since I didn't know it was going on, I think that's enough to answer that question. Well, you better hurry and get something for him, Sonic. Got it. Be back soon. Okay, Sonic, let's see. Before I go out there and look for a present, I just gotta see what Homer, Yoshi, and Shinny got for SpongeBob so that I know what not to get. Bye, guys! Thanks for giving me some beers to see if Spongebob wants to drink some of it for his birthday. Yo, Homer, what'd you get for Spongebob? Well, I got him some beers. Oh, and some type of improved chelly fishing equipment that is like one of those uh, one of the lifetime things. Crap. Wait, how did you get that? I got my ways. Well, what is the way? You know that gold bolt me and Mender, um, uh, got? You mean stole? Well, Mender decided to give it to me to pay for the equipment. Don, I thought you stole them or something. Just because we stole a giant gold bolt doesn't mean we have to steal nearly every single thing in Heroville. Well, crap. So you trying to get a present for him now since somehow you forgot to get him a present? Yes. I thought I was forgetful. Well, how am I supposed to know that Jenny had this planned? Sonic, she's been talking about drawing a party for him since last week. How do you not know anything? Maybe I've been in so many adventures during that week that I forgot. The life of a hero right here, ladies and gentlemen. At least I remember things more than you, Homer. Low blow there, Sonic. Low blow. Anyway, I gotta head to Yoshi. Actually, he's been looking for you. He asked me if I've seen you, so he should be in town. Thanks, Homer. See you later. Oh, come on. Where's that dinosaur? He shouldn't be that hard to find. Sonic! Oh, there you are, Yoshi. I was looking for you. Since I was looking for you, too. Really? Why? Well, to tell you that we have the party in the Krusty Krab ablator today when SpongeBob is finished with work. I know, Smurfett has told me that. But I still haven't found a present for SpongeBob. What did you get him? I got him a golden spatula. Crap. I just thought of getting that for him. Well, Sonic, you shouldn't be hurrying and find him something. Aha! Uh -huh. 
I got something. SpongeBob loves jelly. One of those jellyfishes. So maybe if I can get enough of them, that might work. Well, you will need to find someone who has done that who isn't SpongeBob. Patrick does jellyfishing, right? Yep, he does. Great. I just gotta get him and he can help me with this. Well, if he can sit, this is Patrick Nick we're talking about. Well, but at least once he gives me the basics of jellyfishing. If we can, but hey, more power to you, Sonic. Thanks, Yoshi. See you later. See ya, Sonic! Ah, this stupid alarm system. I thought I'd turn this off. Let's see, what's happening today? It's finally here! I've been waiting for the seed for so long! Well, I can see he woke up and has now gone to the Krusty Krab. Better make sure my present is all sorted for later. Coming! Oh, hi, Smurfette! Hey, Jenny, how are you? Very happy since it's SpongeBob's birthday, and ever since after he did it for my birthday last year, I've been planning for this special day once I finally found out when his birthday is coming. That's great, Jenny. I just decided to come over uh, to give you a cake. I baked for the party later. Wait, where's Sonic? Oh, Sonic is searching for a gift for SpongeBob. Wait, so you're telling me that Sonic forgot to get a gift for SpongeBob? Sadly, yes. I am aware Yoshi and Homer got him a gift. So I am surprised myself that Sonic forgot it. It's kind of sad when you think about it. Well, knowing Sonic, I'm sure he will either get one so fast or get one of SpongeBob friends to help him out. He will either get Patrick or Krabs to help him out. By the way, while we're talking about Krabs, did you tell him that we've been trying to make the Krabby Patties cheaper for SpongeBob's birthday? You bet I did. He was mad, but he clearly changed that mood when I got angry with him. There's nothing more dangerous than an angry teenage girl. Especially robot teenagers. So when will SpongeBob be finished with his shift at work? 6 p.m. And right now it's 1 p.m., so hopefully that will give Sonic enough time to get his present for SpongeBob. I hope so, too. So wearing something special for his birthday? Oh, heck yeah! Remember that dress we bought a year ago? Yes, I do. Planning to wear that. That and some pearls around my neck. Jenny, you're already learning how to dress like a lady. <laughs> Thanks, Smurfette. So now what? Well, I guess we just have to wait until SpongeBob's time at work is nearly over. I suppose we can check on how Yoshi and Homer are doing and see what they got for him. I suppose. Come on, let's go! And here you go, Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. A deluxe Krabby Patty for Mermaid Man and a double Krabby Meal for Barnacle Boy. Thank you, SpongeBob. It's not SpongeBob, you old coot. It's SpongeBob. Who are you again? Spongebobby boy! Yes, sir? I have decided to do something which I have been thinking about since after Mr. Squidward's death. And that would be? To open up a Help Wanted to get a new cashier. You think that would be good, sir? Well, since you're the only two members here, I think we have to do something about that so that the business can still keep going. True, it's just... You know... You miss Squidward, don't you? Yeah. I know that what happened can't be changed. And I just gotta move on. It's just tough at times. I understand how you feel, my boy. But that's just life. We have to move on and remember the good times with Mr. Squidward. But know that someone has to take his place now. I know, sir. That's the boy, SpongeBob. Oh, also... I want you to have another lunch break at 5 p.m. today. Another lunch break? That's weird. You only gave me one lunch break. Well, I thought you deserve another one today. Oh, thank you, sir. Now, time to put up the Help Wanted sign. Hey, Krabs! Hey, Yoshi. Is SpongeBob here? No, he's gone because I gave him an extra lunch break so that we can get this crusty crab I paid for his butt day. Now the others can bring in the equipment for the party. Yeah, better hurry. I don't give out breaks that much. Oh, also, I can see you need a new worker. Yeah, I do. What makes you say that? 
Well, I don't know. Maybe I kind of want to be the cashier for the Krusty Krab. You do? Are you sure you can do that? Oh, heck yeah! I mean, I may it need some time depending on if villains try to attack or attempt to take over the world. Well, I might let it off since I got used to Spongebob doing that for what it feels like every month of the year. What can I say? Heroes are one busy bunch. Okay, Yoshi, you're hired. You can start work tomorrow once we get this party sorted. That's great. Now I will I'll just get some of my stuff and bring it here. Okay, Yoshi. So Sonic hasn't still found a present for Spongebob. No, he hasn't. It's sad when you got a gift and he didn't. I know I should be mad about that. But even I have to agree with that. Hey, guys! Oh, hey, Yoshi! Where were you? I checked with Krabs and he gave Spongebob a lunch break, so now we can put our stuff down there and get the party ready. That's great! Hey, Yoshi, did you hear anything from Sonic? Yes, he has planned to get some jelly from Jellyfish with the help of Patrick. From Patrick? He's better off getting help from Krabs rather than Patrick. Well, maybe once he understands what to do, he, he should get at the Jellyfish very fast. True, let's just hope he can get that soon. So, are we heading down there now? Yes. Mind giving me a hand with the equipment, Homer? Sure, Yoshi. So, what are you two going to do? Well, I got to bring the cake to the Krusty Krab. I will be there at some point. I need to get myself ready for it. I bet she's talking about some new fancy clothes she bought. Homer, let's just get the equipment and leave Jenny to whatever she has to do. Fair enough. Are you going to wear that black dress? Oh, that you got to find out later. <laughs> okay, Jenny. So let me get this straight. You want to get some jellyfish jelly as a present for Spongebob? Yeah, since Homer and Yoshi already got good presents for him. Well, you just got the guy to help you out. I hope so too, since if this doesn't work out, I am going to be so screwed. So do you have your fishing net? Yeah. Now all you have to do is just swing your net around the jellyfish and they should stay in there until you left and go. Well, I suppose that's easy, I guess. But jellyfish are not so easy to catch. They can be sometimes hard to catch. Yeah, so hard you said. That was so easy. Well, you need more than one jellyfish to fill up a whole jar of jelly. How many more? Hmm. I guess 15, but that's not an easy task. If I can caught one while you were still talking, I bet ya I can get 15 of these while you count to 5. Oh, so you want to bet on it, huh? Fine, I will close my eyes and count to 5. Okay, then do it. Fine. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Well? SpongeBob would be proud. Now. Time to get some jelly and finally get this present for Spongebob. Well, you better hurry. It's only like 30 minutes until this party. Oh, crap. Thanks again, Homer, for carrying the heavy stuff. Wait, I was given a choice. <laughs> oh, hang on. I'm getting a phone call. Hello? Hey, Yoshi, just wondering, are you and Homer bringing the equipment down? We sure are. What about you, Smurfette? I have the cake. I will be down at the Krusty Krab real soon. Jenny, however, will be there after some time. Is she getting herself all dressed up for the party? Oh, heck yeah. Figures. Anyway, see you on the Krusty Krab. Bye, Yoshi. Okay, let's go. I'm glad you two are here. Where's the others? They will be here really soon, just before Spider-Rob comes back. I might get a feeling Jenny might be saving the last present for him. How so? Well, you will see, Homer. I'm finally here. Oh, look. Sonic eventually found a gift. Took you long enough to get one. So did you get some jelly from Patrick? Well, he just gave me the basics of it. I was able to get the present in about a minute. At least he got that in time. Here I am with the cake. Hey, honey. Oh, Sonic. You got SpongeBob a present. What is it? Some jellyfish jelly. Oh, when I use the jellyfish jelly, I am seen as a bad guy. But when he does it, he uses that as a present. 
We did use a giant factory to forcibly get jelly from them. Shut up, Patrick. Yeah, I don't remember when Krabs gave me a second break from the Krusty Krab. Happy, happy birthday. birthday! Whoa! Happy birthday, dude! I knew something was up when Krabs gave me an extra break. Clever boy. Glad to see you catching on when things look off. <laughs> yeah. Hey, where's Jenny? Oh, she will be here real soon. Until then, time for you oh, to say what we got you. I got you a new jellyfish in equipment and net. I got you a golden spatula. I baked you this cake. It's your favorite type. And I got you all of this jelly. Wow, now that's a lot. I take it you went to jellyfish fields. Yeah. And got help from Patrick since you never did jellyfishing before. Yeah, I did. <laughs> At least you're learning. <laughs> yeah. I'm here! Oh, hey, Chenny, how... I... Sorry that I was a bit late. I have to make sure I was all ready. It's... okay. Impressed? Beyond impressed. <laughs> then that means it works. We will just leave you two alone. Thank God that we didn't invite Sheldon over. But he's over her. Thanks to Vega, remember? I even think with that, Sheldon would be going crazy seeing Jenny in that dress. Homer has a point there. So did you get the gifts from the others? Yes, I did. Good, because I wanted to save mine for last. Now with that, let me finally get my birthday present. Ever since you first gave it to me when we traveled to another dimension, I knew I had to get something to show my love to you. Ah, Jenny. Thank you so much. Anything for the sweetest guy I know. Now, let's party! Thanks, guys, for this amazing party. No problem, SpongeBob. <laughs> you deserve it, SpongeBob. Man, you know something, Nick? It's good to finally have a day where we didn't have to get involved in something like this. I know, Strong. It's good to finally enjoy the day. Especially in this crazy place. Hey, Nick, can I talk to you for a second? Oh, sure, Carrots. Be back soon, Strom. Okay, Nick. So what is it, Carrots? I know isn't the right time to talk about this, but this is really getting serious. Always going with the serious stuff, Judy? Ugh, what is this about? We have tried someone as the new head of the police force. It's been years since... Bowl died. I know, Carrots. It's rough on me, too. I have tried my best to find someone, but I can't seem to be finding someone. I'll tell you what, Carrots. After the sponge's birthday, you and I will try to find a new chief of police, okay? Okay, Nick. I guess we can still have fun today. Come on. Let's just enjoy today. Okay, Nick. Ah, it's so good to finally see a new city. But it's even better. When you find out an old friend is there. Oh, Simpson. I will show you what you get. You shouldn't have crossed paths with the former lead of the EPA 12 years ago. Oh,